Hi, this is Tina for the Crafty Traveler, and today I'm down in Southern Maine with my sister Jean. Hi. And it was raining since last night, what, around 9 p.m.? Yeah. And it was raining right up until 1 or so this afternoon, so we decided we would go thrift shopping. And we went to a thrift shop down in Auburn. Yeah, yeah. Auburn, Maine. It's the uh, Androscoggin home health care and hospice uh, thrift store. And I happen to work for them. And it is all volunteer that runs the store. They have two stores, one located in Auburn, Maine, one in Augusta, Maine. It's all volunteers that run the stores and all the items for sale are all donated items. And the money they raise uh, is used to provide free health care for people in the community that um, don't have insurance or coverage and they do well over one million dollars worth of free health care per year yeah that's amazing huh yeah that's a good cause so yeah so this this uh, it's not a very big place no and very very clean it's like it's not everything's not packed in there everything isn't thrown on shelves it all has a certain order very clean and then uh, as soon as people are taking items out, they're right up there filling in that space again. So, uh, and the people are so, so friendly there. Yeah. Every time we've gone in, they're super friendly. Yep. So uh, Mostly older ladies yeah. that run the stores. Yeah, there must be volunteers and oh, yeah. whatnot I, coming in, huh? Yeah, very nice. So, okay, so we will show our little finds here. So one book Jean picked up. So I, I go to the thrift store often to look for large print books. Um, I am a speech pathologist for the agency. So I pick up any large print books I can get for some of the uh, older folks that we work with likes them. So their hard covered books are $2 a piece and the soft colored, a uh, soft color. Uh, yeah, soft, soft cover. cover. <laughs> soft cover books are $1. They have sales so, very often. See how big the print is. Yeah, they. Uh, Which it makes it nice. Yeah, Heck, I could use it myself. I can't see nothing without my glasses, but I can go and read it. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's all. My yeah. eyesight is. So that's that's a good deal for books. Yeah, and they have sales all the time on the books. Yeah, it's endless. I mean, the books, the dvds the uh, cds they have are very very inexpensive for people wanting to buy movies or music uh dvds cds yeah i, I know the dvds or I think cds they were what, piece. yeah they were a dollar yeah yeah i was surprised on that too yeah when i seen that yeah so okay so jean does a lot of cooking she's a very good cook by the way and so she's uh, bought different dishes here to put her spices in because she does some video taping here as well. So she wanted some pretty dishes, you know, to put like some cinnamon in, some, you know, oregano, whatever you're making. And um, so that was her major look for today. Mm -hmm. So she has uh, five of these little white dishes, like little flowers. Mm -hmm. And they were two dollars each. Oh, yeah, they don't say who they're from. No. These were with a set of dishes from Dansk, I think. Mm, yes. So I think that's what it is. Yeah. So my goal is to start a YouTube video shortly, you know, soon in the near future for puree and food and just instructing people on how to do that, uh, people with swallowing problems. And so I needed all these kind of little dishes for dry ingredients and some little bowls and dishes for some wet ingredients and then i wanted some other small little bowls for displaying the food once it's pureed so these are by tag and these were two bucks a piece and i thought That's these pretty. yeah these are very adorable cute little bowls never heard of tag but no me neither they're dishwasher safe but that will be a very cute little display to you know small portions or wet yeah. ingredients and these are kind of these like little pottery. Yeah. yeah. These little. are like Italian kind of thing. They're what? Nantucket home. Yeah. It says. But it makes you Italy, you know. Yeah. Kind of a feel and has a little rim. Yeah, they're very around. cute. These were $2 a piece. Little pottery type bowls. Yeah, we've, we, I bought every little bowl, they, every little 
kind of container they had. And this was just a dollar, just a one by itself. Mm -hmm. So of course we had to grab that. We can just leave it there. So that's cute. And then these ones here are, well, I didn't take the sticker off the, what does that Signature. Say? Signature. Yeah. So little yellow ones. And they have like a little, uh, it almost reminds me of the top of a pie crust. Yep. The, yeah. the top. Yeah, I think these are my favorite. I don't know why. I like. They them. always have a lot of dishes there. Odds and ends, little things. You know, like you know, all these different things, odd numbers of things, two or three or even one of something. Yeah. But they always have wonderful choices of these little glass containers and such. A lot of cookware there. Yeah. Odds and ends. Their big thing is, and they go through a lot, is uh, complete dish sets. Their dish sets are usually thirty-five to fifty. But they're, they're large piece yeah. sets. Um, they have your tea cups, your teapot, your gravy yeah. bowl, your plates. They sell a lot of them. It's, you go in there, they're always new. But that's a wonderful place to set up for people uh, setting up a new home. Yeah. And they're like in mint condition. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I, I don't think I've seen anything in their chip. So I don't think they oh, put no, anything they chipped on the floor yeah. or anything like that. So yeah. you're getting good stuff. Now, I wish I'd seen this before, Jean, because this is pretty cool. It's a dollar. Oh, let me get my glasses. I don't know. Oh, okay. oh, it is plastic. Yeah, it's plastic. Yeah. But it, all the going around it, you have like um, for ounces, for cups, for teaspoons, and for tablespoons. Probably grams. So it's all together. Yeah. So I, that, that. Yeah. And it's got a nice little pour look. Yeah. So. Yeah, that would be cute. The very that that was a good find. Yep. These are the last ones. And then you want to what puree some soups and stuff. This yeah. is kind of what this one will be. Simple additions. So yeah. So after I make the recipes and such, then I thought the white would look really nice to display the different foods and the colors would come out really nice in these little dishes. So yeah, yeah. And it's just nice to. Repurpose and not have to go out and buy new dishes, and I got a wide variety at for pretty inexpensive forty dollars, I think, for everything I got today. Oh, yeah. cool. and then you oh, have a cup. My mug. <laughs> I always look for coffee mugs in there. They're a dollar. <laughs> it can't be a dollar, but they always have like the cutest mugs, and I just like random coffee mugs for some reason. But they're so nice for just nice big one openings for tea. Uh, cups of soup or whatever yeah yeah but for some reason I am addicted to looking at their and they always have a huge selection of mugs there a lot of often they have sets of four or six sets of six or eight but then you'll have a random cup yeah so. yeah I had quite a few of those yeah so that that's it for Jean yeah and then I really wasn't shopping a whole lot because where I'm moving I just don't want to have a lot of stuff but I came across this. It's like the little rubber cups that you put under your table legs or a heavy stand or whatever so it doesn't sure. um, scar up your flooring and stuff. That was only a dollar. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's a find. <laughs> I will find somewhere to put this for sure. And then they had a material. This was only two twenty-five a yard. So I got that. And it has little bunnies all over it. Isn't that adorable? I think it's Peter Rabbit, huh? Yeah. The characters. Yeah. So I couldn't resist that. I thought, oh, I'll get that. Just, and I'll uh, probably make something for my granddaughter even. Though she's nine years old who doesn't like rabbits, right? You don't grow out of rabbits. So I'll do something with that for her. And that was it for me. Yeah, that's kind of um, a... A new little corner, uh, the craft one. They have sewing machines coming in, material, mm -hmm. yarn, but they kind of have like a craft section and that's growing, but yeah. that's kind of been a new addition in the past six months, I'd say. Yeah. Yeah. They had a Singer sewing machine and I mean, it looked new Yeah, and it was $45 if I remember. I used 40 to $45 and I thought, geez, that's a good deal because yeah. they're usually around $100. Yeah, and like I said, this looked new. Even the box was yeah was in new condition that was sitting beside it. Uh, what? Yeah, quite a few 
uh, racks of clothing, yeah. probably what, 10 racks oh, of clothing, yeah. probably. That's their pro well, yeah, it's probably half of the store is their clothes. Yeah. Not for children, adults, men, women. Uh, yeah. Pretty decent shoe selection. For men and women. Yeah, jewelry. Uh, um, yeah, quite a bit of jewelry. I was surprised on yeah. that. They had them all Accessories. Hanging. Um, like on a nice display and so they're all spread out you know so you can just stand there and just uh, look at everything um, had a nice set of handbags there was a few name brands I couldn't tell you right now but they were in good condition and they were like ten dollars mm -hmm. um, yeah so everything that was there is very reasonably priced and like I said the ladies are all nice and it goes uh, to a good thing so mm -hmm. uh, if you're ever in that area stop in and say hi yeah they have a store in augusta mm -hmm. maine and they also have a facebook page so they upload pretty frequently weekly at least once weekly i would say uh, new displays and show new things that they have so yeah and you have quite a bit of stuff in your house that you bought from there <laughs> yes <laughs> right <laughs> A lot. Seriously. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And I mean, a it's lot. beautiful. It's right. just, uh, they have beautiful. a lot of home decor things. You yeah. Know, a lot of um, just decoration, home decorating. Yeah. Um, a lot of um, pictures. Lot. Yeah. 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 A lot of brand names. L.L. Bean. They had a lot of L.L. Bean stuff. They always have a lot of L.L. Bean, LL Bean clothing. Yeah. Footwear. Yeah, especially because you know, Portland's right here, right? So. Freeport. Yeah. Yeah, Freeport. Yeah. yeah. So. Yeah. All right, so I think that's it, huh? Yeah. So it was fun. It was a fun day. And then uh, this afternoon, uh, we're going to do another little project together. So hopefully we'll get that videotaped later tonight for another time for me to upload. <laughs> We've been messing around with a little few little things. Some things go good, some things don't, right? It's all a learning curve. So for now, the Crafty Traveler, and you'll see my sister again, I'm sure, more videos with me. And uh, please subscribe and do the thumbs up so I have some more viewers come on in. Mm -hmm. Until then, have a good day. Bye. Bye.